Welcome to Financial Assets Allocation Strategies video. In this video, we will describe the different financial asset allocation strategies. After going through this tutorial, you must be able to select the appropriate strategy for asset allocation. Would you like to earn from our investment? It is one of the best way to earn more money and become wealthier. How to earn from the investment is the next question. To earn maximum amount from a single product, proper asset allocation is essential. Let's understand what is asset allocation. While preparing an investment portfolio, investors want to invest funds in more than one investment products. Asset allocation helps in selecting an investment product and helps in deciding how much funds should be invested in different products. If a product doesn't work, well, then the investor may have to suffer huge loss. To avoid this, one has to follow certain strategies for effective asset allocation. Let's look at types of asset allocation strategies. Three main types of asset allocation strategies are Strategic Asset Allocation Tactical Asset Allocation Core Satellite Asset Allocation Next, let's look at each one of them in detail. In this asset allocation strategy, the assets are spread across a variety of asset classes on the basis of their past risk-return trend. Let's take an example to understand this. The investor has allocated 20% to the property. The sector performed better and it becomes 30% of his portfolio. In such a case, as per the strategic asset allocation strategy, investors should sell the property and use the profits received to rebalance the portfolio by again allocating 20% to the property. Once an investor has done asset allocation by adopting a strategic asset allocation strategy, he or she needs to rebalance his or her portfolio after a predetermined period, say after every one year, and bring it back to its original allocation. Therefore, the strategic asset allocation strategy involves staying committed to the original asset allocation for long periods instead of responding to the current market changes. Next, let's look at the second type of strategy. In tactical asset allocation strategy, an investor starts with the basic allocation like 50% equities, 20% property, 10% bonds and 10% cash. Next, the investor observes the market. If he or she finds that share valuations are high, he or she will sell his or her exposure and if he or she finds that valuations are too low, he or she will increase the exposure. Thus, tactical asset allocation strategy involves continuous review of the portfolio based on the changes taking place in the market so that the required action can be taken at an early stage. In a hybrid of strategic and tactical allocation strategies, core satellite asset allocation includes two components, namely core holding and satellite allocation. The allocations made in the assets under core holding component would not change over a period of time. But the allocations made in the assets under satellite allocation component can change with time based on the changes in the market. The satellite allocation component provides a more active approach to an investor and he or she can take advantage of the market trends without risking the entire portfolio. The summary of the tutorial on financial assets allocation strategies has been put on the screen. I will pause for a few seconds to allow you to read it. Based upon situations and prevailing circumstances, choose the strategy for assets allocation to earn maximum profits from investments.